Hi there boys and girls. I am in my treehouse again today. Um, last time when we read a story, I read it to you from my patio and you can see the treehouse in the background. But today I'm back up here and I have a new book. This one is called The Apple Pie Tree and it is by Zoe Hall and the pictures are by Sherry Halpern. So let's see, what all do we see on this tree, on this book? <laughs> I see two birds, one, two, a bird nest, and it's sitting in, the bird nest is in a tree. What are these growing on the tree? Apples, and what's that? A little butterfly. I picked this book today because as we've been doing our calendar time this month, we have been talking about Thanksgiving and we have been, our pattern has been a turkey and a pie, turkey pie. And I thought it might be fun to read a book about pie and I'm gonna make an apple pie for Thanksgiving in a, in next week, I guess. So I thought this one might be fun. My sister and I have a tree that grows the best part of apple pie. Can you guess what that is? They made a picture of the ingredients they needed for their pie. It looks like there is there are cinnamon sticks and butter and sugar and an apple and flour. Which part do you think grows on the tree? That's right, the apples. And every year we watch our apple tree grow. In the winter, our apple tree is brown and bare. Are there any leaves on the tree or apples? Not in the winter time. But in the spring, leaves grow on every branch. And look, two robins are building a nest in our tree. Tiny pink flower buds appear on the branches. The robins chirp loudly, guarding their eggs. Can you see many, how many eggs there are? One, two, three. Just when the flower buds open, baby robins break through the eggshells. So now look where the three little eggs were. There's now one, two, three baby robins. Now our tree is covered with blossoms and the baby robins begin to grow feathers. So the birds are getting bigger. Can you see anything in this picture that likes the blossoms? Oh, the Bees like the blossoms, don't they? And the butterfly. When breezes blow, the petals fall to the ground. Mama and Papa Robin teach the little birds to fly. Some days it rains and the wind blows hard, but our apple tree is strong and the robins are safe in the branches. Can you see them over here? Small green apples grow where the blossoms used to be. So after the blossoms fall out, we saw them falling to the ground and a couple pages back, little tiny apples start to grow. Soon it is summer and the apples get bigger and bigger. The little robins have grown up, but they visit every day. My fingers are cold out here. It's tricky to turn the pages. 
<laughs> okay. The branches bend down low and they are covered with big round apples. So we saw that the bumblebees and butterflies like the blossoms. Who likes the apples? That's right, the deer. The deer like the apples and the squirrel. Now it's autumn. The apples are red and ready to be picked. We fill our basket to the brim. Now autumn is another word for fall. We talked about that a couple of weeks ago. So when the apples are ready, it's the same time of year we're in right now. Mom and dad help us peel the apples, cut them up and pile them into a pie shell. Then we sprinkle cinnamon and sugar over the top and mom puts the pan in the oven. At last, the pie is cooked and ready to be eaten. Our tree has grown an apple pie. It smells so good. Now, did the pie grow in the tree? No, but the most important part of the pie did. And it tastes delicious. There is nothing as good as an apple pie that you grew yourself. And look, the children love it. And that's the end. I like this story and I like apple pie a lot. So I'm excited that I'm gonna be making one. Now, I don't have an apple tree in my yard. I just have maple trees in my yard. But I ordered some apples from the grocery store that I'm gonna be able to use. So that's going to be fun. Well, I hope you have a good day. If you go outside, wear your coat. It is cold out here. And wear your gloves. I couldn't wear my gloves and turn pages, but I will put them on soon. <laughs> Enjoy your day. 